Welcome back to the channel. My name is Tronage and today we're talking about drone drop. This is the February box. I just received it and you know how that works. We got to unbox this. Stay tuned. All right, so here's how it's gonna go. Signed up for some drone drop action. Subscribed, pay my own money, figuring why not get some parts. If it's something I can use, I'll do something with it. If it's something I can't use, maybe I'll give it away to you guys. Not sure yet, because this is my very first box and it just arrived. And as always, I unbox things legitimately. I don't unbox it, play with it, and then put it all back in the box and watch it with you. I'm actually gonna open this for the first time with you. So come on in, let's crack the seal on this guy and see what's inside because I'm dying, I have no idea. So here we are, drone drop box, fresh off the presses or fresh out of the mailbox, if you will. So I will crack the seal and let's see what we got inside. Ooh, cut good. Felt like a good vinyl sticker instead of those paperish kind of ones, that was good. A satisfying feeling. All right. Share your drone drop using the drone drop hashtag. Okay, maybe I'll do that. All right. So as always, I'm gonna give you guys the first look before I even see it. Are you ready? What is it? I don't know, I can't see. Ooh, stickers. All right, so. Let's dig into this, because I am so excited. First one ever. So we got some drone drop stickers. Cool, like them. Another set of stickers. Pretty cool stuff. Got to have those little ones to put on your goggles. Ooh, we got some props here. Some drone drop race props. They're basically Dow Prop Cyclones. And they are 5046. I will get some actual good use out of these. I could use some 5046 props, some Dow Cyclones. And the color's pretty cool too. Nice little reddish orange color. That will go great with a build that's gonna be maybe started on Monday. Stay tuned for that. All right, another set of props. How do you go wrong with a set of pro another set of props? And another set of props. How do you go wrong with three sets of props? Gotta give props to Drone Drop for props. Put those to the side. What do we got here? Ready-made RC. Do, 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 looks like a battery pad. Yes, black gel pad. So we, basically a battery pad that you'd put down to cushion your battery. Might have a little stickiness to it, I have to see. In fact, why not while we're here, let's just, nah, I'm not gonna open it just yet. Oh, it is sticky, because I can see it's got the plastic topper. So this is gonna be um, a very sticky, gushy goodness right here. This is gonna be an awesome battery pad. I'm excited about that, I'm gonna actually need one of those. What do we got here? We have some real ACC brand, um, Standoffs that are vibration dampening, basically to soft mount your flight controller. You put those in your stack and your uh, flight controller won't get the vibration so your gyros won't wig out. That's pretty cool. Might actually use those too. Not sure yet. Ooh, look at that. Foxier Predator Mini camera. That is pretty cool. I was not expecting to get a freaking camera in this deal. Holy crow mini. That's right, Chromini, look it up. But Fox here, Predator mini camera. I'm excited about that. What else we got here? This looks pretty cool. I don't know what this is. Let's see, what is this? Can't tell by the skew, looks like tweezers. But let's see here, this, I'll open this packaging bag up. 
see what we got here. Yeah, we got a set of some tweezers. They look like they're non-conductive style. These are awesome when you're doing assemblies to get those wires right into place for soldering. We got the straight and we got the angle tip. Those are awesome. Those will be really useful when we do some uh, assembling. And we got a Velcro, this is actually a high quality Velcro strap. Like it's got, it's like beefy metal and it's like really good like silicone grip to it. Let's just see about how big this is. And see how, yeah, that's gonna be a really good size. That'll be like good for like a 4S. That's like perfect. I might actually be using that on my next build too because that is a nice beefy uh, strap. And lastly, this box I was excited about. Let's see, what is this? Just says a skew. So it's a surprise, it's a box within a box. Let's see what's inside. Oh, open, dang it. There we go. It's heavy, what is this thing? Okay. Oh, I think I know what this is. I was actually looking at these on Amazon. Okay, so what this is basically is a, um, uh, a big giant block of metal that you can use when you're doing your power connectors like your XT60s and whatnot, and you clamp them into this big chunk of metal so that this way when you're soldering them, the things don't melt and get all super hot and everything and it kind of holds it all and keeps it all in form and it keeps it held nice and tight. That is pretty cool. And it just has all the different battery connectors that you just open it up, pop in whatever size you're doing, using, you clamp it down. Kind of weird that, is it backwards? I think they have it on backwards. Yeah. They do, look at that. All right, so, cause the things aren't lining up proper. And I think it's cause it's on backwards. Yes, see that's how it's supposed to go together. They had this flipped like this and things weren't lining up properly. So this is supposed to go like this. So now let's reassemble it back the way it should be. Now, put the springs on. Thought I was doing magic over here. Oh, sugar. Okay, I got it, I'm under control. I just shot a spring in my, this, these springs are freaking insane to work with. All right, now let's make sure I don't put this on backwards like they did. That's correct, okay. Oh boy, this is gonna end badly, I think. All right, no, no, wait, hold on. Don't lose it. Did I get it? I think I got it. All right. Oh boy. Okay. All right, tragedy averted, ladies and gentlemen. We got it fixed. All right, so now you can see how this is supposed to be. I don't know what this thing is called, but I know it's basically when you're making your uh, XT60 connectors and whatnot, you put them in this little template, this little jig, and it keeps them all nice and happy. So your XT60 is right here. And uh, yeah, it's basically like a little jig just to hold everything together. Not quite sure what all this stuff is on the edges, but hey, part of the box, and it's pretty cool. It's a nice color red too. So let's see here, box sheet. We got the Foxy Predator Mini. We got the anti-vibration screws. We have the solder station tool, which is this thing. Maybe that's like to figure out wire gauge or something. Maybe that's what those little holes are for. That might be what that is, wire gauge. I don't know. Um, the steel tweezers, the gel pad, the props, the battery strap, and the stickers. Missing an item? Let us know. Nope, it's all here. Cool deal, man. So there you go. Drone drop unboxed. February 2018. Whole bunch of goodies in here. I'll just do a little throw, throw together here to make it look all cool. Yeah, throwing all kinds of stuff. 
that was a decent box. I got. I ain't gonna lie. I'm. I'm pretty satisfied, especially getting this camera. That was. A, that was a nice treat. I'm. I was. That. That. That made me happy. So there you go. Drone drop. Boom. All right. So basically, what I did is I ran the numbers, did a little quick search online to see what the costs of these things were, and I'm gonna share that with you. So I'm gonna put it up on the screen here so you can see and follow along. But essentially, what I did was I broke it down item per item. And I did like a retail price, whether I could find it on, if it was like a specific item, like the ready-made RC battery pad that I looked up the price on ready-made RC or Amazon, or basically a retail price that you can get here in the United States. And then I looked up a price from like Banggood or GearBest, like basically a China price to see if that would be any cheaper. And then to make it fair, I basically averaged those two numbers together to get a average value of the item and as we go down you can see you know the foxier predator mini is basically 41.99 across the board meanwhile you have something like the solder station tool is basically 16 dollars on amazon you can get it on banggood for 10 bucks so that averages out to be 12.99 you know however you want to look at it so i put all three numbers to see how you want to look at this information. I also included the cost of how much it, it costs to buy the drone drop box. So you have your one-time cost, which is $49.99, and you have your subscription cost, which is $39.98. And I subtracted that away from the total value of the items inside this February box. And as you can see at the bottom there, how much value was over the cost. So basically, if you take if you take how much the box cost, how much extra did I get out of the deal? And if you look at the retail price, it's between 47 and $57 bonus free stuff, if you will. If you look at the China prices, you're looking at 22 to $32, depending on if you're a one-time or a subscriber. And on average, with all the prices, you're looking at about 34 to $44 worth of savings. So I would say, this is obviously my first box and I can't imagine every box is gonna be good because when I looked at some of the boxes in the past, some of them weren't so good. But this box is my first experience hands-on and I would say it's a pretty darn good deal. You're basically, it's like double your money depending on how you look at it. I paid $40 and I got $97 worth of stuff. That's like over double the value of my dollar. And if you look at the China prices, which would be your worst case scenario, I paid $40 and I got $70. It's like almost double, a little less than double. So for me, this box was a definite hit and everything in there I think I can find a use for. And like I said, after I have a chance to actually think about it and do whatever, there's a couple items in here I don't use. They'll be coming up on a giveaway, so look for that in the future. But overall, first-hand experience on Drone Drop, I'd recommend it. Again, I paid for this out of my own pocket. I did not get, get it for free to review it. Good value for the dollar, at least for the February box. And as a little teaser, I did also sign up for the Quad Box. Haven't received that one yet, but when I get that one in, we'll be doing an unboxing and a review of that too. So as always, my name is Tronage, fly strong. I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, you really should subscribe. I'm always posting new content. If you'd like to help support the channel and get access to giveaways, raffles, and other exclusive benefits, consider joining the Tronage family on the Patreon page. Here's some videos that you might be interested in. This is the latest one that I posted and this one I think you might just like. Go check them out.